What's going on, y'all? This your boy Slick 50 back with another episode of Wavy Wednesdays. First and foremost, I want to get this out the way. I want to thank everybody that showed up to my live today that actually took place maybe 15 minutes ago. Man, we kicked it. We had waivers, sneakerheads, some of everybody in that joint. You understand me? So if you ain't notified, man, hey, hit that bell, man. Sub up. Hit that like button. Boy, we was over kicking it for about an hour and 20 minutes, man. It went so fast, though, man. I like doing live podcasts because I get to interact with you interact with you guys. You know what I'm saying? You get to ask questions. I get to respond. You know, it's just, it's just a lot better than me recording my podcast. I'm still going to do my recorded, recorded podcast for Mondays, but... Look out for your boy going live a lot, um, doing a live podcast. You know what I'm saying? So, shout out to y'all again. Like I said, if you missed it, it's up, up there. Check it out, man. And also, sub up if you ain't sub. Hit that like button. Hey, go a long way. But, moving on from that, I haven't said that it's Tuesday. So, I'm recording this on Tuesday, but you're seeing this on a Wednesday, right? All right. <laughs> um, today's subject, we're going to talk about what a lot of people are having problems with is getting waves on the side of their head. Or it's like very little waves. So I'm just going to go down the line and then I'm going to take it a step further too, okay? Um, to correct some mistakes. So the first that I notice a lot of people do, they brush here. They just, they start here and go here. They don't start here or they don't start here. So first and foremost, always start on the side of your head. Because sides are the toughest to get your waves on. So, and your back, bottom, back. So always just start on your side. Show them a little more love, especially if you really, really got real coarse hair. Show them a lot of love because the top of your head always gonna get touched. You know what I'm saying? Whether your hands doing this or whatever, or what you don't do this. You know what I'm saying? So start here, right? Um, another thing too, if your wave cap isn't tied properly and it's loose, and you go to sleep, your hair gonna curl up. It's gonna sweat. It's gonna curl up. The purpose of the wave cap is to help keep your hair laid down. You feel, you feel where I'm coming from? Um, so make sure it's pulled tightly. It's on properly. This isn't how, y'all know this isn't how I wear my wake up. I did this for example. Um, if you have a wake up that's not broken yet and you got that little tint up here, flip it up. You see that? This is the wake up. Pull it down over your face, flip it up, then turn around tight. Now, this to me is wrong, but to each his own. You know, usually your flaps uh, spread out and go around. You know what I'm saying? Which helps too, because you'll get about this much more coverage on there. But if you don't like doing that, and that's too time consuming. You know what I'm saying? There's other things that are out there to help you. One thing that you will need that does help, if people got wave caps that slide, like this cheap poly I got on, that slide around in your sleep, get you a stocking cap. And put it on and hold your wave cap in place. A lot of people think the stocking caps are uh, for compression. They really don't add that much compression around here. What it does is it gets real tight around here, like almost like a rubber man kind of. It does help in the crown area a little bit, but that's where it's going to pull down from. But mostly it holds your wave cap in place. And that's what I use it for. All right. Um, that would definitely help. But if you're even going further than that, any more problems than that, uh, you could buy things like this right here. This is my, this is my girls. That's what they do use when they wrap their hair. This thing right here, this guy, it's a girl thing, you know what I'm saying? Don't laugh at me, don't laugh. Shut up laughing, god damn it. <laughs> but um, it's, it's just strictly for the size of your head. So you would put it on like this, boom. You know what I'm saying? Pull it down and tighten it up. And you get all this extra compression on the sides of your head. You know what I'm saying? Don't laugh at me. Quit laughing. But <laughs> but you get what I'm saying? So, and in the back, extra compression on down here. You feel me? So you can get these at you can get these at the dollar store, bro, at the beauty supply. Um, or you can just, you know, that's too girly for you. Because you don't want to see it, use it in your sleep. But at the end of the day, you can have uh, a bandana folded, get that like two pot. Get the extra compression. You know what I'm saying? There's ways. But it's all about the compression and teaching your sides how to lay down like the top of your hair. Because remember, most of the compression in your wave cap is going to be focused on top of your head. And the sides are kind of loose. Now, 
once you get your waves in the, on the side of your head, there's some things you want to, like, you start getting real nice. But we always get the forks. Sometimes the forks ain't your fault. Well, it is your fault, but it ain't the way you brush them. That's what I'm saying. It be the wave cap. And I'm finna show you because if you had these wrinkles right here and you land on them, they, they will indent your waves. And you'll start seeing that pattern of that wrinkle coming your way. So I'm gonna show you the wrinkle. I set up an example for you guys. So, as you can see, this is the infamous wrinkle on a wave cap. You see that? That is ass. You do not want that. You see that? That will lead to a fork in your waves. This one too. You don't want that. So you want to try your best to make sure those are gone. Whether you have to pull here. That's why y'all always see me pull my wave cap down on the sides. See how it disappears? See that? Well, if you got to pull that out, smooth it out. Okay? Make sure there are no wrinkles there because they will lay into your waves and become one fork that you will not like. I mean, and it, it take hell to get out. All right? I'm going to take this off and another thing, show you another thing. Like I said, I don't even wear my wave cap. Like, but this is a trick. Like I said, I'm going to show you what I'm talking about first. This is my wave cap, right? My hair dirty, but... I don't even wear this thing for real. It's a play a ball or something. But look, now I'm gonna pull it to here and pull it down. See that down, that tent? See this? That shouldn't be there. See that? This shouldn't be here. This little, like I call it Ku Klux Klan little point. That shouldn't be there, right? So what you wanna do is pull it down. And a lot of people already hip. This for the new, you know, my newcomers. Pull it down at least to your nose. That's what I do. See a tent right there should be in the middle of your head. Flip it up. You know, then take the straps back, right? Tie it up however you want to tie it. Ain't no wrong way. Some people like flying their stuff out, right? I'm just doing it fast for the video sake. Boom. Say I just tied it up like that. Come back here, pull it down. Again, you got the thing that's on the side, so you pull your sides down. You know, get them out. We can't have that, right? Boom, boom. It ain't perfect, but you'll get it perfect. You feel me? Boom, boom. But ain't no tent. There's no tent. It's gone. Okay? So, if you get a wave cap and just don't fit right, you can make it fit. You feel me? You get them wrinkles out. You know what I'm saying? You can get them waves on the side. It's just going to take a little hard work and dedication. You can get these for the extra compression. So, you have... Because this is going to move. See? This is going to slide back up. That's why you got to constantly pull it. But if you get one of these, you know, little strap things put on your head, or um, a bandana, you know what I'm saying? You'd be good to go, bro. Like, real talk. It'll hold that compression. that Because if you touch it, you feel it's loose. But it's not up here. It's real tight. You can see it pulling. But right here, it's, it's tight, but not like here. So, you, even the odds, man. Grab you one of these. It's for, like, when girls wrap their hair up or whatever. And you'll be in the game, man. You know what I'm saying? So, um, or a bandana. You know what I'm saying? And that's how I got my waves on the side. Not necessarily using this thing. I'd use this probably once or twice before. It wasn't this one, though. But <laughs> it was all black one. Um, you can buy me out every color. Um, but I started using bandanas. And that's how I got my waves deep, just as deep as on top. All right? And it is going to take some time wolfing because usually our sides are a lot thinner than the top because we sleep on the sides of our head. So you may have wolf a little longer. You know what I'm saying? And you'll start seeing that progress. You feel me? Um, shout out to Dave VIC, man, because I told him, you know, he thought we'll cut out wave Wednesdays. No, I'm not. This for you, man. And all my wave was out there, man, to watch your boy. Um, my dude called me the waveologist. With, uh, <laughs> Oh my god, I'm not good with them damn names, man. I keep forgetting, but shout out to you too, man. Uh, but it is what it is. I always like take a step further. You know, I can tell you I get waves on the side, but like I said, the main thing, you don't want to start forks by your wave cap. Like I said, you know, sometimes it'll be how you brush. You'll start, and just because I told you that, start looking how people wear their wave cap. You're like, damn, he got a wrinkle right there. Damn, he gonna have a fork. He go, it, and it's, it's true. I don't tell you nothing I don't know because I done made that mistake more than once, man. Because you lay on it and they put that indent in there. 
constantly, man. And you end up with that nasty fork that just don't belong. You know what I'm saying? So make sure that's why it's important to have your mirror. It ain't got to be this big fancy mirror. You know what I'm saying? Say hi to y'all self. But um, it's good to have a mirror and check. You know what I mean? Like I said, so we had 10 minutes and some change, man. Again, I appreciate everybody who came through that live. I like to see a lot more of y'all there, man. You know what I'm saying? So make sure you uh, subscribe and notify, man. Hit that bell for your boy. Um, yeah, I think that's it, man. So y'all know what it is, man. I'm going to wash my hair, get this stuff in order. You feel me? And um, yeah. It's your Wave Wednesday from your boy Slick 50, man. Y'all know what's up, man. Y'all be easy. Be safe out here, man. All right? One.